overnight bus chase spanning three boroughs. It started around two in the morning when a man reportedly jumped into an American Airlines bus that was left running in a lot at Kennedy Airport. That man leading police on a wild chase for more than 15 miles. Eyewitness News reporter Derek Waller was at the scene where it finally came to an end. Well, this guy was all over the city. That police chase ended here in downtown Brooklyn. And today we're learning the suspect's name and more about his past. I'm going to jail, right? I'm going to jail, right? That's the question 43-year-old Bershawn Quilden of Classen Avenue in Brooklyn asked officers as he was handcuffed overnight in downtown Brooklyn. Quilden is charged with grand larceny of an auto and criminal possession of stolen property after they say he hijacked this American Airlines shuttle bus. A Kennedy Airport employee saw it happen around 1.40 in the morning after the bus was left running in lot 12. There was no one on board and no one was injured. The employee followed it and called police. That chase started at JFK. Cops followed the bus down the Van Wick, then the Grand Central, crossing over to the FDR, down the east side, and finally across the Brooklyn Bridge, where the driver finally stopped on Cadman Plaza West. Well, perhaps the driver was trying to take the bus back to the airport, but instead, he got a trip to jail. Now, police say Quilden was on probation for a 2015 robbery.